and welcome. My name is Mr. Robert Lee Williams, founder of Prophetic Information Ministries, where we blow the trumpet, the shofar, around the world, informing you with prophetic news and bringing God's miracle ministry to the world. This is a message I personally do not want to deliver today, but the Lord has put it on my heart. But I must read the scripture to you first. Ezekiel 33, 3 through 6. If when he sees the sword come upon the land, he blow the trumpet and warn the people, then whosoever heareth the sound of the trumpet, he taketh not the warning. If the sword come and take him away, his blood shall be upon his own head. He heard the sound of the trumpet, and took not the warning. His blood shall be upon him, but he that taketh warning shall deliver his soul. But if the watchman see the sword come, and blow not the trumpet, and the people be not warned, if the sword come, and take any person from among them he is taken away in his iniquity but his blood I will require at the watchman's hand well today I am blowing the trumpet to show fall especially in the state of Texas and in the Dallas area Today is April 17, 2012. Around noon today, I was in my kitchen uh, pouring myself a glass of tea. And while that time, I had uh, one of my flashbacks, I guess, to an old dream that I had many years ago. And I've had hundreds of these flashbacks, you know, you, you dream something and then somewhere down the line it always comes to pass. Well, I saw myself in the dream when it came back to me, I was pouring the, tea, the glass of tea, wearing the same clothes that I had on at the time. And when that dream was coming back, you know, I said, oh Lord. What is this? And what I got was a large tornado that would cause a lot of damage. I do believe it is a large tornado or it is something that is very large that will cause a lot of damage. Either in the state of Texas but or in the Dallas area. As most of you know, about two weeks ago, here in Arlington where I live, in the Dallas-Fort Worth area, we had several tornadoes. You know, one did come close to where I was at here in Arlington. I just went out in the storm and spoke to it and told it to go over and go someplace else. That's exactly what that tornado did. And I praise God for that. But... I'm here to give this warning out. Like I said, either to Dallas, Fort Worth area, or in the state of Texas. This is a message I do not like to deliver, but I'm being obedient unto the Lord. I'm just following scripture here. But we are at a time in history where great distress is coming upon the land because we are in the last days. These are the days of sorrows. You know, that's just the way it is. But I'm talking to my fellow brothers and sisters here in the Dallas-Fort Worth area. If you do not know Jesus as your personal Lord and Savior, 
I would encourage you today, right here and now, to make Him your personal Lord and Savior, so you can be saved. As I said in one of my previous videos I did within the last month, I stated, the Lord put on my heart to state, that the gates of heaven and the gates of hell are open, and they are about ready to receive thousands and millions of people, I believe this year around the world. This is a prophetic warning. Please, please, I care about you. I love you. And I don't want to see anything bad happen to anybody. But I want you to get right with God. You get right with the Lord Jesus Christ. For when we all do not know when our time will end. But now is the time for if, you're, if you die today, where would you spend eternity? Would you go into the gates of heaven or would you go into the gates of hell for eternity? This is no game. This is real. You've got to answer that question for yourself. If you're telling me you do not know where you're going to spend eternity, then let me help you get into the gates of heaven. I want you to repeat this prayer after me. Dear Heavenly Father, Lord Jesus, I admit I am a sinner. I have broke your commandments, Lord. Please forgive me and come into my heart. Wash my blood, wash my sins away with your blood. Jesus, I know that you died on the cross and you did shed your blood for me and you did rise three days later. I thank you for that, Lord. Come into my heart right now and you live in me. And Lord, you are my Savior. And I thank you for it. Thank you, Jesus, for saving my soul. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Now, if you said that prayer, I want you to email me put a comment here on the YouTube site there that you were saved today or if you are another watchman if you had a dream or a prophetic warning send them to me and I'll put them up on my website or you can put them up on go to my website at propheticinformationministries.com and put your dreams and visions up there. There's a place for you to do that. Because we need, the body of Christ needs these warnings. We need to, to save the lost. But if we, the Christians, the called out ones, if we're not out doing our job for God, look at all the millions of people who are going to go to hell. And I don't want one to go to hell. But it's up to you and me to get the warning out to the people and to show them that the Lord Jesus Christ loves them very, very much. And I'd ask you to be a good example in your community. Show the love of God to all the people that are around you. Be a good example. I'm going to close right now. But I'm going to continue to pray 
that these storms and destruction does not happen. And I would like your prayers as well. Let's pray for the Dallas, Fort Worth, Area and the state of Texas. Let's pray before it's too late. Let's try to pray this thing off if we can. So, you all have a great day. May the Lord bless each and every one of you. Until next time, this is Minister Robert Lee Williams, founder of Prophetic Information Ministries. God bless you, and I'll talk to you later.